Hi, this is Mike Enriquez, and I'm the author and presenter of the Toughest Stuff CT Registry Review Seminar. Today's Something to Know lecture has to do with organ-based tube current modulation. Now, organ-based tube current modulation is one of four types of tube current modulation presently employed on modern multi-detector CT equipment. The other three include angular tube current modulation, which is tube current modulation in the X and Y plane, and longitudinal tube current modulation, which is tube current modulation in the Z axis. The fourth type, in addition to organ-based, is ECG-based or electrocardiogram-based tube current modulation, which is tube current modulation that is based on some specific, some specific point in the ECG, the electrocardiogram. Now, with regard to organ-based tube current modulation, I think it represents an alternative, a viable alternative to bismuth contact shields in particular. And in, conven in conventional mode, organ-based tube current modulation is reactive to angular and longitudinal modulation. In this manner, beam intensity is maintained at all view angles. That's why when you look at the diagram under conventional, tube current modulation is represented as even exposure in the entire circle or helix around the patient's body. So that means that sensitive areas are getting exposed to just as much radiation as other areas of the body that are lesser sensitive. When we look at organ-based tube current modulation, the beam is either off or very much minimized over sensitive areas. And in order to maintain a semblance of visible detail, however, beam intensity and therefore exposure has to be increased at other view angles. That's why the diagram is represented as a darker red in that area where exposure is taking place. In the area above the body, in the, on the over the anterior surface, the sensitive areas, there is either no exposure or very little exposure, limiting exposure to breast tissue, thyroid tissue, or the lens of the eye. That's what makes, I think, organ-based tube current modulation a viable alternative to the bismuth contact shields in particular. Well, thank you for your time and attention. If you're looking for more help with your CT registry studies, make sure you check out my online on-demand webinar at www.radprof.com. Thank you. Have a great day.